In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to create a metallic button in Photoshop. First of all, select the Ellipse tool, draw a circle and open up the blending options. Now move over to the Drop Shadow tab, change its blending mode to Soft Light, set its opacity to 50%, distance to 1px, spread to 0%, and size to 0px. Once done, move over to the Color Overlay tab, choose 101010 for the color fill, and click on the OK button to apply it. Now duplicate this layer, decrease its size, clear its layer style, and open up the blending options. Move over to the Gradient Overlay tab, choose CE, CE, CE for the left side, center, and right side gradient, and 7E, 7E, 7E for the middle gradients. Position the middle gradients to 25% and 75% respectively. Once done, choose Angle for the style and move over to the Stroke tab. In this tab, set its size to 1px, choose Gradient for the fill type and click on the Gradient option. Choose 7E, 7E, 7E for the left side 999999 for the right, choose Reflected for the style, and click on the OK button to apply the changes. Now make a rectangular selection over the button, insert a new layer, and press the Alt plus Backspace key on the keyboard to fill it with the foreground color. Once done, go to the Filter menu, select Noise, and click on the Add Noise option. Set its amount to 400%, choose the Uniform and Monochromatic options, and click on the OK button to apply it. Now go to the Filter menu again, select Blur, and click on the Radial Blur filter. Set its amount to 100, choose Spin for the Blur method, Best for the quality, and click on the OK button to apply it. Once done, Change the blending mode to Screen, Control plus click on the circle layer to load its selection, press Control plus Shift plus I on the keyboard to inverse it, and press the Delete key to delete the selection. Now select the Custom Shape option, choose a triangle shape, adjust its size, and place it over the button. Clear out the layer style and double click on it to open up the blending options. Move over to the Drop Shadow tab, set its distance to 4px, choke to 0%, and size to 4px. Once done, move over to the Outer Glow tab, choose CE, CE, CE for the color, and set its size to 7px. Now move over to the Gradient Overlay tab, click on the Gradient option, choose 1B, 1B, 1B for the left side, 41, 41, 41 for the right side, and click on the OK button to apply it. And that's it.